World News Tonight with Peter Jennings. Good evening, everyone. Tonight and tomorrow as well, no doubt, the country will inevitably be reliving the chaos and confusion of the 9-11 attacks in 2001. It's been long enough now that we add the year to the day and the month. Tomorrow, the independent 9-11 commission will publish its full report on the attacks and how they could have happened. We're going to begin tonight with a very painful reminder that in the hours before the attack, how easy it was for the five men to get through the system and on to American Flight 77, which crashed into the Pentagon. Our chief investigative reporter, Brian Ross, is here with us tonight. And we have just managed to get our hands on a videotape of these men going through security at Dulles Airport. And I'm going to ask the control room to roll. Would you please talk us through it? It's a surveillance camera, Peter, that was in the ceiling at security at Dulles Airport. Beginning at 7.18 that morning, the first two hijackers make their way through security. You identify them in the picture? They have been sent to the first primary area, and now in the middle, the first of the two hijackers comes through. They set off a red alarm because they are being given a secondary screening. The red light on the right you can see. The guard begins to use his metal wand to check. There are distractions, there are people moving around. Uh, there's no explanation in the end as to what set off the alarm. The hijacker tries to get away. He's stopped by the guard, Peter. The search continues, but nothing is removed from the man, and he and his companion then make their way down the concourse to the gate of American Flight 77. We've only looked at this a couple of times. Do they appear to get through security fairly easily? Fairly easily there, and then again we see another hijacker coming through, the pilot, Hani Hanjur. He checks two bags. They roll through the metal detectors. Nothing goes wrong. He takes his bags and he heads down. And then finally, about 15 minutes later, Peter, we see on the tape two more hijackers going through security. They again, Peter, set off the alarm. Mm. They're sent to the secondary position. They use the handheld wands, but nothing shows up and they're sent on their way to the gate for American Flight 77. Many thanks, Brian. As I said, we just got the videotape and it now becomes, of course, part of the public record.